sometimes you want to go right into the general ledger and do your transactions that way. Now, when you do these normal transactions, it'll update the chart of accounts. But here's how we can maybe um, do this manually. If I pick on the company menu, then you can go into uh, then you can go into make general journal entries. Okay, so uh, it talks about the account numbers. If you want to turn those on, I want to click on OK. So let's say we're going to make um, we're going to take it from our bank account, and let's say there is a credit of one hundred dollars. Now, when I go to the next line, notice how it automatically is, is going to assume that you want to make a debit for the other account, right? So let's say in this case, um, let's say we're going to have something that, let's say we, we pay the, um, the electric bill or the telephone expense directly. All right, so the, uh, the business check got credited, the telephone account got uh, debited, and uh, so this is exactly how you can put in your general ledger entries manually if you wanted to. The way we got to the screen was we picked on company and then uh, make general journal entries. All right, I'm going to pick on save and close. Now the proper accounts would have been updated if I look at my chart of accounts. Notice how the checking account went down and I'm sure the, um, the account for the uh, electric bill went up. All right, And we can start to see that.